Today we're gonna learn how to boost details on your photos and protect it from losing quality after uploading in Instagram. And be sure to watch till the end because you would love to know the secret. Okay, if you're ready, just launch your Photoshop and let's do some editing. So when you open your photo in Photoshop, the first step will be duplicating the layer. For this, just click on the layer and drag it into this little plus icon down below. Now just press Ctrl Shift U on the keyboard to desaturate your photo. This action will take all colors from the photo. Also, this action can be done by clicking on Image, Adjustment and Desaturate. Now click on the copied layer with right mouse button and choose Convert to Smart Object. This action will allow us to manipulate the level of sharpness of the photo in the future. Now on the top menu bar choose Filter, Other and High Pass. Use this little gray square to navigate around the photo. So our task is to make main lines of details on the photo more visible. For this, just start to move the slider to the right and check how it looks like in the gray square. And be sure to not go too much here, because when you only start to see some details on the photo, this is already a good sign to stop and not overdo. I will go with two pixels and click OK. Now we need to change the blend mode of the layer from normal to linear light. And you already can see how details of the photo pop up just by clicking on this eye icon near the layer and switching off and on. To not cut eyes with such sharpness, just decrease the opacity of the layer by clicking on opacity with left mouse button and drag your mouse in the left side. And now the secret of all good quality Instagram photos. Wait, be sure you clicked on the subscription button and already put a big thumb up to this video. <laughs> okay, I can tell you, the secret of all Instagram photos is setting the right ratio and dimensions of the photo. For this, we are going to the left toolbar and choose crop tool, set up four to five dimensions, crop image. Now go to the top menu bar and choose image image size now very carefully if your photo was taken with a phone you need to set up these dimensions and if your photo was taken with a professional camera you need to set up these dimensions please pay attention on these dimensions i don't know why but this is the magic numbers that really works click ok and now you're ready to export your photo for this click file export export as gpg and done! Be sure to leave your comment down below and share with me how your photos have changed after this simple but still so amazing editing trick. And of course, thank you for watching this video till the end. From you a big thumb up and from me, as always, many new editing tutorials in the future. So, see you very soon, stay in touch!